morning YouTube it's Friday and I did not get to finish my vlog yesterday which means I left you on a cliffhanger for sure I didn't post it or anything I'm gonna continue to lift leave you on a cliffhanger till the end of the video but my wife and I found out what we were having yesterday and it's a joyous occasion so I'm really happy for us and um, it's going to be a new adventure I don't think I can wait till the end of the video uh, we are going to be having a little baby boy which for me is uh, pretty cool I'm a little nervous a little excited at the same time but uh, I'm really happy and uh, takes a little bit of pressure off of my brother because he hasn't had children yet with his wife and if I was gonna have a girl oh my gosh my mom or dad would have been like you need to have a boy so we can carry on the name but you know it is what it is I'm really happy and um, it's gonna be a good adventure a good ride and I uh, can't wait so <laughs> All of you guys out there, all you people out there subscribing to me and talking and watching my stuff, please give me some advice because I have two girls already and I have no idea how I would raise, a, well I know how I would raise a boy but it's going to be tough to start off so please give me some tips um, for sure and uh, definitely need some uh, <laughs> So the thoughts and prayers for that one for sure. If it's gonna be crazy, I can already tell. If it's anything like me. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. It's Friday. Not payday, but it's still Friday, so that's a good thing. I've been working on getting my vlogs out every day now, so um, I'm still recording, but it, I'm getting better at when I'm uploading them and when I'm uh, editing them so this week I had some extra time to get things done and in to the computer and things so I'm at 110 subscribers I think unless I've got some last night um, shout out to Aaron Yeager from Japan still not sure about that YouTube account but they drew me a picture of uh, Star Wars. They want to email it to me. So email it to me. I think my email is attached to the account. I don't know. Or you can post a picture in the comments, I guess, and I can download it. And I guess you could always do that. Uh, just upload it to the comment section. That'd be pretty neat. So um, I'm at a, at a crossroads right now with uh, driving. So I'm at kind of a big extensive intersection see if anybody's gonna let this car through probably not because nobody's nice anymore um, see if uh, I'm at a red light this intersection right here is kind of lame it's definitely a problematic thing and it I have a green light go <sighs> sorry for the road rage but people don't pay attention they really don't and that's one thing that really bugs me down here where I live is there's a lot of drivers that really don't pay attention to anything and um, they get impatient kind of like me what I did there but you know I'm trying to be nice to let people through but when it's my turn to go it's my turn to go you gotta abide by the traffic laws but anyways, down here, not a lot of people pay attention, and that's what bugs me. So, rant over. It's Friday. I'm ready to go, ready to finish map testing. I really don't like map testing, but, you know, it's one of those things that you have to do, I guess, as part of your job. But I just think there's so many much testing. We, I've already did a video on this already. So you already know, as a teacher, there's, there's so much testing already. Um, but I'm just excited for the weekend. I'm going to work on my fence this weekend. I'm going to 
I gotta weed whack my yard because of all the rain that we've had the last few weeks. It's just made everything explode. And down here in southern Arizona, they don't really, the, it's always dry, so there's not really a much grass. But whenever it rains, all the grass and weeds and wildflowers that have been, you know, underground the whole time, they just bloom and just explode at this time of year. And so, um, I got to do that today or this weekend, you know, and that's a big job. I have almost an acre of land and it takes a long time to do that. It takes several hours, maybe like five or six total. But I mean, that's only one, it's only one me. So if I had more people working with me, I might be quicker, but I normally don't. It's just me. Um, so yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, I'm pretty stoked. I'm having a boy carry on the name there's some names that my wife and I have been working on and fixing and change, uh, talking about and uh, we'll let you know what the name should be in the future um, comment below what you think I should name it chances are I probably won't name it but anyways it's nice to hear some of those comments um, so yeah this morning I will be doing a drinking coffee with Matt. We'll have some special guests. Uh, you can watch that video later. Maybe I'll put a card of it right here sometime. I can't remember. I need to do that on my videos more. I need to start promoting my videos more uh, so I can get more viewers. So I'm really trying to get big, you know. I'm pretty close. Uh, I'm closer now to 200 than I was three weeks ago. But, you know, I ultimately have that goal of 100,000 subscribers, which I don't know how that would even happen. But, again, my whole channel is all about positivity, and positivity brings positivity. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, last night was open house for my school. So I got to meet some parents and stuff of the students I have and uh, get to know them a little better. But the one thing I don't like about open houses, it's, you know, it always seems like there's not enough time. I mean, I'm not complaining about the time, but I never really know what to say with the time that they give me to talk because it's really short. So, and it's always kind of intimidating when you're talking to a bunch of parents in the room. Um, for the first time and you're still barely getting to know their students too so it's kind of awkward at, at the same time uh, but it is what it is so excuse me last night we stayed up stayed up late watching um, the second to last Harry Potter movie so my wife and I the last like three weeks been watching the Harry Potter series and um, I love Harry Potter. I love the books. I got Tales of Beetle the Bard. My keychain my keychain is the Order of the Phoenix. Um, it's pretty solid actually too. It's a metal keychain. It's pretty sick. Um, it's like one of the only keychains I actually have on my key ring for driving. Um, but anyways um, we finished the second to last film and I love watching the films but the films are not as good as the books and they always leave out those little 
is because I'm processing what's going on, but it was refreshing. That series was really nice, and it just was so magical. And I really want, I mean, it's one of those things like you want to be a part of that world, like you wish that world was real, and you want to be a part of that world. Like, I always think to myself, man, it'd be so cool to be a wizard because if ever I had a mess, I could just flip out my wand and clean it up real quick like the house in, in uh, the Half-Blood Prince uh, Dumbledore and Harry go to this house to meet this wizard guy and um, the house is just trashed up and Dumbledore just flips his wand and cleans it up in like one minute and I'm like man I wish I could clean my house like that you know do my laundry like that make dinner that fast I mean I see I just I don't know it'd be pretty cool or to apparate I mean I wouldn't even need a damn car if I could just apparate and wave my wand and think about where I wanted to go you know I, I could visit my family whenever you could where. live wherever you wanted in the world and you could visit your family and friends whenever you wanted you just have to think about where they are and go there I just think that would be nice, you know, I just do, that would be cool, and now I'm just rambling on, so, um, I'm almost to work, I want to bid you guys a farewell, maybe I'll talk more about Harry Potter later, if you wanted me to talk about Harry Potter, if you've made it to this far in the vlog, write Harry Potter in the comments, please, so I know that you watched the video, and I know that you want to talk about Harry Potter. Until then, peace out.